us. All the early mornings, all the sacrifices, all the sweat. It's for right now. All that hard work, all winter, all spring, all summer. Yeah, it's for right now. Stand on that and leave it all on the field. Give it everything you got and let's make this season one to remember. Yes, that clip from UNLV football's Rise and Grind web series. The Rebs are in fall camp right now ahead of an historic season. And joining us this morning to talk about that season, it's UNLV football coach Tony Sanchez. Good to see you this morning. Good to be on. How you doing? Doing great, man. The season's getting closer. Excited about it. Good stuff. So we've got a couple of things we need to talk about uh, this morning. First, let's talk about this. We're going to talk about go looking back in time as we look also to the future. This is a neat addition to UNLV. This is a retro helmet. Tell us about it. Yeah, well, you know, it's our uh, 49th year in Sam Boyd Stadium, last year of the stadium, and uh, this helmet was worn uh, in that first year when it opened up. So we figured uh, we'd have a little throwback helmet to kind of celebrate the, the history of the program and the stadium. And, uh, of course, it got rave reviews from our friends up north as well, right? The Wolf, the, the UNR fans are huge fans of this, from what I understand. Uh, yeah, I understand that, too. Uh, we we weren't really so thinking about them when we came up with the design. <laughs> it was more about the Rebels. No, fair enough. And that, I, 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 the retro looks really, really cool. Now, as you mentioned, it's the last season for the Rebels at Sam Boyd Stadium before moving to the Raiders Stadium, Allegiant Stadium as we should call it. Tell us about saying goodbye to, uh, to good old Sam Boyd. Yeah, I tell you what, it's been a great home and, you know, and obviously you know, we've, uh, we've had some good moments in, there, in that stadium and I know the, the Rebel faithful that have been coming out and supporting the Rebels for a long time. It'll uh, kind of be bittersweet, but excited about moving into Allegiant Stadium. That's going to that's gonna be a game changer for the program. And your history in football here in the Valley goes beyond UNLV, of course. I imagine you have some other memories just of being at Sam Boyd Stadium even before you with uh, UNLV? Actually, my last college game I ever played at New Mexico State was at Sam Boyd Stadium. So that was the last game and then had a chance to play there when I was at Gorman and then now all of a sudden it's, it's been home for the last, uh, we get ready to go into five years. So it's a good place. Good stuff. All right, so coming up this year for you fans out there looking to try and lock in some prices for the football season, let's talk about fan faithful pricing, uh, what people can try and do to get ahead of uh, getting into Allegiant Stadium. Well, the great thing about the fan faithful pricing this year is uh, whatever you get into the stadium this year, you get in uh, their season ticket that pricing will carry over into Allegiant Stadium, so it's a great deal. Now, we should also talk about the actual team. I guess we've talked about retro and the stadium and the pricing, but how did the team look this year? Uh, ended great last year, beating UNR, uh, of course, to wrap up last season. Uh, let's talk about this year. What are your expectations? We're excited. We have high expectations. We return, you know, a deep roster, especially offensively, 18 of the 22 back. Armani Rogers is healthy. It's important we keep him healthy. And I'm really excited to see the defense this year. Tim Skipper's done a really good job of leading this group. More depth on the defensive line and linebackers than we've ever had. Got to eliminate the big plays. That was something that kind of was a thorn in our side last year. So I think if we can do that and uh, you know, keep our guys healthy, I think we have a chance to make a hell of a run. And, uh, and we were just talking about in the commercial break, the schedule for the year. You've got some, uh, some bigger teams like your Northwesterns and so forth, but uh, the rest of the schedule, how does it shape up for you guys? You know what? I, I think it's pretty status quo. I mean, you, 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 know, you, you trade out some of, the, some of the teams that we played last year on the other side of the division. Boise comes back in, Wyoming comes back in, Colorado State. So mm -hmm. excited about those guys. You know, and getting teams like Boise at home and Hawaii at home with a lot of the others. I know the fans get excited and jacked up about that so um, and then you always end it with uh, you know the game against Reno so it, it's going to be a, a fun exciting season I think there's a lot of opportunity for us ended last year with a pretty decent taste in our mouth for Rebel football so we're ready for a good season coach Sanchez thanks again for coming in appreciate you again this is pretty cool stuff can't wait to see that in action as well all right we'll root for the Rebs as they get ready for the new season and uh, we'll check them out on the football field meanwhile